in ancient Greece, one option for people experiencing fear, uncertainty or anxiety would be to consult with the Delphic Oracle. As people approached the temple, they would have to walk past a message. Two simple words, know thyself. Knowing ourselves as individuals means knowing three things. First, our purpose, our guiding North Star, our reason for being. Maybe it's about leaving the world better than you found it, or becoming the best version of yourself, or creating a legacy that people will remember. Second, our values, the things that are good, and therefore what we care about most deeply. Things like justice, knowledge, family and equality. And third, our principles, ways of making sure that our decisions are the right ones, identifying the lines we'll never cross. Like the golden rule, treat other people the way you would like to be treated. Trying to make a decision without purpose, values and principles is like being at sea without a rudder. We'll be pushed around by the winds of our desires, mood, unconscious mind, group dynamics and social norms. The choices we make won't really be ours. The same is true for organisations. Just like individuals need to know who they are, organisations need to have some ethical commitments woven into their DNA. This is what's known as an ethics framework. An ethics framework is a statement of an organisation's purpose, values and principles. It makes clear what they believe in and what standards they'll apply. It's a roadmap for good decision making and if it's lived throughout the organisation, it's also a guide to making an organisation the best version of itself. But to do this, the framework needs to meet four standards. First, be stable. Consistently revising your values and principles or changing your purpose leaves no reliable foundation for making good decisions. Second, make sense. Jargonistic documents that are full of the latest business buzzwords don't mean anything to people when they're facing a tough decision. Third, be practical. If it can't be put into action, it's just window dressing. And lastly, be authentic. If it's not an honest statement of who you are, it's not gonna mean anything when life gets hard. Every organization has to navigate uncertainty and competing requirements while making decisions. Pressures of time, money, and group dynamics can push an organization toward choices that don't represent who they really want to be. An ethics framework will help steer you toward decisions that represent the best of yourself or your organization. It's a guidebook to wise, self-aware decision-making. Know yourself. Know your organization. Make choices that reflect what you believe is good and right. Choices you can justify and ones you can be proud of. That's what makes the choices actively yours.